the most important thing when you're scanning sheep is to have a good contact. We get that with a gel feed system. Gel onto the, the groin area of the ewe. Good contact, what we can see in the screen here. The dark areas, which is the amniotic fluid. We're scanning through. Here we have a backbone with a rib cage with the head to the left. Coming back, coming back. We have another body in a cross section. And here's the head. You observe donut areas, shaped areas throughout the pregnancy as we scan through. These are referred to as the cotyledons, which the afterbirth's attached onto. There's a very bright head. Scan through, scan through, there's a the neck. Keep scanning through, coming into the body. Right through, right through, right through. Here's the second body coming. It's joined up with the head. All together. Lovely pictures. To measure the age of that lamb, if we look at the widest part of the body, we can gauge the trunk diameter. It corresponds with the, the middle circle in the top left of the screen, which is about 80 days. So she's probably somewhere between 75 and 80 days. The important thing for scanning sheep is to make sure you see all the uterine content, so you continue the scan until you lose all the pregnancy, but still have a good contact. Like that. Then you come back. Back. Right the way back to the back of the pregnancy. So one body, two bodies, right through and out. Set of twins. Okay. Fourth thing when you're scanning, make sure you get good contact. Your gel coming out of the probe. Gel, contact, low, forward, through. Body, head, out, back, back, back. Second body, second head, twice. Gel, contact, low, forward, body, through, second body, head, out in front, back, head, body, body, head, twice. 